So, how many walkers do you think James will help us get? Fifteen? A hundred? A thousand? Clem, I don't... Ow. Gunshot wound. It feels like someone pinched me from inside. Here, let's rest a second. Clem... I keep thinking. When Willie said all that stuff about Tin before, I got so mad. He was being mean, and Tin wasn't even there to defend himself. I wanted to hurt him. I know I shouldn't, but I just can't stop thinking about it. I want to just punch his head. I tried breathing, kicking rocks. I don't like this feeling. Wanting to hurt somebody? I know it's hard, AJ, but thoughts like that, they go away. You just have to give it time. Uh, waiting's hard. I'm just thinking too much. Like, I think... I think I'm mad at Tin, too. Running out of cover when Lily attacked the school was really stupid. But he just doesn't know stuff like we do. And then, Willie started yelling at him instead of helping him learn. Why don't the other kids know all the stuff we know? When there's a plan, you have to follow it. And when you yell at someone, it just makes them not listen. Well, why don't we teach them? They're smart. Someone just has to show them what to do. Yeah. I want Tim to know how to be safe. We can show them how to be smart, like us. It's weird that people are so different. It is Erickson's boarding school for troubled youth. Troubled youth? Trouble like bad? So they did bad things? Why? <sighs> okay, um, sometimes they do them because bad things happen to them. I knew a doctor once, back when you were just a baby. He called it trauma. You have some too, you know. The thing where people can't walk up behind you? I don't like my trauma. I want to get it off of me. How do I get rid of it? I don't even like the way the word sounds. Eh, it doesn't work like that. It's too deep down inside you. It never goes away. That sucks. But you can resist it, just like anger. I still like them. I like Tin the most, I think. Even if he does dumb things. Actually, I think he's my first real friend. Oh yeah? I thought I was your first real friend. Well, yeah, but you don't count. You're old. I am not. Fine. He's my second first real friend. I don't see James, just monsters. <clears throat> James? You're hurt. Did the Raiders do this? It looked like they had people from your school. Why are you here? Those people you saw, we're going to save them. But to do that, we need your help moving some walkers. Maybe help, but my mask is still in the camp, inside my bag. I can't pass through a herd without it. Okay, then let's go get it. Please, I just... 
I just ask that you don't kill them. The walkers. If you distract them, I can sneak over and find my mask. Distract all of them? Please. I'll... I'll try. Draw them away. Are you okay? Yeah, no bites. <sighs> you didn't even try to spare them. Thank you for helping me get this back. Now, how will walkers save your friends? They're being held captive on a boat not too far from here. We can't sneak on board without cover, not without the raiders gunning us down. You want to use walkers to hide? To sneak on board their ship? That's insane. It's our only chance. I... I have something I need you to see so you can understand what you're asking. James. We still need his help, right? Yeah, we do. <laughs> it's safe. Just a little further. Clem, what's this? It's called a salt lake. Salt lake? Ugh, sounds gross. Or maybe it's actually good, like chips. Those are salty, right? Like the snack bag in the car. Go ahead, lick it if you want to. <laughs> <coughs> oh, gross. It tastes nasty. <laughs> well, now you know. Oh, learning sucks.
My people, my former people, they had a practice. They called it collecting. They use them as a weapon. I do this to protect them. I know it sounds strange, but that's why I brought you here. To see them as I do. As people. As people? Well, not people exactly. But... <sighs> something in between. Part of us is still in there. Deep down. So few of us die anymore. We turn. Not dead, not alive. I wish I could see it that way. It'd be nice to think that everyone isn't actually gone. In a way, they're just lost. Do you really think there's people inside of monsters? Somewhere. Yes. Think about it this way. Has someone you cared about turned? Clem's friend, Lee. She shot him before he did. So he wouldn't have to suffer. Sorry. Maybe this wasn't the best way to explain. Didn't mean to bring up difficult memories. I lived among walkers for years. Still do, in a way. When they're alone, they're harmless. Innocent. If you want my help, I need you to try and walk with them. Then tell me if you really believe they're just... monsters. They are just monsters. They're not people or friends. Clem! She'll be safe, I promise. This isn't smart. It's too dangerous. She just needs to move as they do. Lewis would do it for us. Yeah, I guess. The first rule is never go alone. I'm not leaving you. I'll be right back. Check the windows. I will. Remember to breathe. I will, I promise. The mask will disguise your scent, but be gentle and be quiet. Touch the wind chime. You'll see.
Oh, hey there, kiddo. It's all right, I'm fine. See? No bites. No bites. So, do you still think they're just monsters? Now that you've seen them at peace, any different at all? I... I think you might be right about there being something more to them. It was kind of nice in there. Really? I never met someone who understood. It's... Thank you. I'm glad. Have you ever killed a walker before? I have. Many. Have you ever killed a person? Many. But that was a long time ago. I've killed someone before, too. AJ. You've killed someone? But I was justified. I see. <sighs> That's enough. What about the walkers? Are you going to help us save our friends? I thought I could, but I can't. So many walkers would die. All of the death this would cause. I'm sorry, Clementine, but I can't have more blood on my hands. You saved AJ and me because you said you didn't want us to become soldiers. What makes it okay this time? They're going to make all our friends into killers. More violence, more death. And you could have stopped it. I may be stubborn, but I'm not heartless. Those raiders are cruel. They force others to be the same. And if your friends are anything like you, I don't doubt they're worth saving. It'll take some time to guide them through the forest to the shore. Others will join the herd as they go. Tomorrow night, be ready. I can't undo this. There might be people inside walkers. Did you mean it? Is he right? Well, we can't know for sure. <laughs> Maybe he's right. Death might not be like we thought before the world turned like this. Maybe something is left after we die. Oh, that sounds weird. But if you believe it, I do too. Come on, AJ. Let's get back before it's too dark. I've never met anyone like James before. I mean, he's tough. Not like you, though. He doesn't kill monsters, but he's not scared of them either. He's cool. Hey, Clem. Willie told me the plan. How'd things go with that guy? James. He agreed to help us. If somebody told me we were gonna sneak onto a boat and a herd of walkers, I'd have called them crazy. What are you doing with those? Oh, well, I wanted to throw one last hoot nanny before the big fight. Swear? Huh? It sounds like a swear. No, it's just another word for party. Right. I know it sounds strange, throwing a party, but people need something to lift their spirits right about now. 
This could be our last chance. Mm. I want to make some tea for everyone. Could I borrow your little heater thing? What can I do? We need to pretty up the old music room. Could you make us something colorful to hang up? Okay, I'll be an artist. I'm gonna make the deck, uh, the decor... Decoration. A decoration for the party. Okay, I'll get the heater. School pride. How's the drawing coming? Can I see? Nope, it's not done yet, but it is pretty good. I'm done, Clem. Come see. Okay, be right there. Hey, you're getting better at this. Soon you'll be as good an artist as Ten. I don't know. He's really good. Something wrong? AJ? I was just thinking about stuff while I was drawing. There are three kind of eyes, Clem. Hmm. Oh, yeah? There are live people eyes. We got those. Then there's monsters' eyes. They usually look like dirty water. Other times, monsters' eyes aren't even wet. And then there are live people eyes right as you kill them, like you did to Abel. His, his eyes look like you blew a candle out. He was a bad guy. I know I shouldn't feel like this. I hated him, too. I think there's something wrong with me. You know what, AJ? Everything you're feeling is okay. It makes you a good person. Am I good? I wish what we did felt good. Part of me wants to like it. I'm getting real smart. <laughs> is that right? Yes, because I'm always thinking all the time. Okay. What are you thinking about right now? You getting bit, turning into a monster. Oh. Yeah. The older I get, the more I see it. I don't know why. What happens then? Anyone can get bit. It doesn't matter if you're inside or outside or how careful you are. AJ, we've talked about this a lot. If I get bit, you know what has to happen. I don't want to talk about this anymore. But you brought it up, so we're going to. It does something weird to my stomach, like I'm gonna get the dookies. <sighs> AJ, I need to know you remember what we talked about. What you're supposed to do if it happens. Listen to me. If I get bit, you'll... Shoot. No. No, I'm not gonna do that. AJ, you promised. I don't care. I'm not gonna shoot you. If you get bit, I'd want you to bite me too. What? You don't mean that. I wanna be alone. Please don't be mad. I can't live with you not with me, Clem. I know we've talked about it so much, but don't make me. Alvin Jr., if you have a gun, you shoot me. If you don't, you use your knife. No knife, a rock to the head, as many times as you have to. I said I don't wanna. I don't care what you said. You will do it. I don't care what you say. God damn it, AJ. <sighs> you can't break promises, AJ. I know. 
You're not letting this go, are you? James said... <sighs> Guess not. That we could be around when we're monsters. Like on the inside. If you got bit and then bit me, then maybe we'd still be together. It would just be a different together. We might even be okay. You think so? AJ, I'm done. We're not doing this anymore. You're gonna drop it or you're in big trouble. I mean it. Why can't you just be nice to me, stupid Ed? AJ. What's with AJ? He just needs some space. Can we talk about what happened today with Minnie? Yeah, sure. What's wrong? The thing is, seeing Minnie, I feel like it should have scared me, but it didn't. The person we ran into in the woods, that wasn't Minnie. Not really. The way she sounded and acted, the way she talked about Sophie and Lily. <laughs> I'm, I'm confused, I guess. We can still save Minnie. If we brought her back, we could... You saw how she reacted when Lily showed up. Those are her people now, and we are not. Minnie, the real Minnie, she's gone. She's been gone this whole time, and I have to stop mourning her. I won't let her take you or AJ, or anyone else I care about. Louis knows when to keep his head down. Yeah, shit. Oh, I, I hope so. You know, when I first got here, I hated him. He was so much. You know, he walks into a room and it's like, look at me, watch me perform. It's so stupid. But then I realized under all that, he, he really cares about people. And he doesn't just feel it, he says it. He'll tell you every goddamn day how much you mean to him. Shit, he'll probably sing about it. Especially if there's already a famous song with your name in it. We've got to get him back. We will. Louis Omar Asim. We'll get them all back. Um, I made you this. Stars. So you never forget that night. I never will. When you told me you had feelings for me, I was shocked. Then I started thinking. There's something I've always wanted to try with someone I cared about, and I never have. What is it? Have you ever danced with anyone before? <laughs> nope. Do you... wanna? Just us. No one else around. I mean, I know it's kinda weird, but it's... something I've always wanted to try. Thanks for the dance. Yeah, we're getting better at being romantic. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Clem! <laughs> wow, where did you find a beach ball? It was in some garbage behind one of the dorms. I had to blow it up, and, and that was pretty gross. But look, it works. <laughs> I should get going. Ruby could probably use some help.
Hmm. I thought you were mad at me. Well, I am, but I still wanted to show you. It's cool, right? Super cool. <laughs> Back! <laughs> You're terrible. Hey! I love you, Clem. And I'm sorry for calling you a dumbhead. It was stupid head. You called me a stupid head. Oh, <laughs> right. I love you back, kiddo. <sighs> okay, we better get ready to go. Sounds like they need us in the music room. Okay.